Hello, this is Paul with another video, and we have a few more things to show you that I found. So let's get looking at them. The first thing is going to be Hot Wheels, and I don't collect these that much, but if I see something that's cool, I'll, I'll take it. So the first one is this Audi 90 Quattro. I thought this looked like a cool piece here. And it's from the Retro Racers, 6 of 10, new for 2023, so it's a little older. And it looks like it's from, is that the A case? Hmm. I don't know if this one. It's pretty cool with all this race deco on the sides. It's cool, you got the front end deco, the Audi logo number four, Audi Quattro, GT4 Hot Wheels, Audi, Audi Spawn, but no details in the back because you got everything on the sides and the front. And then it's cool, they put a windshield wiper. And then they put a net on this side. That's cool. So there's the, the Audi. Okay, folks. Sorry about that little interruption there. Um, let's continue. And I found two of these. And these Hot Wheels I actually found at a grocery store called Winco. That's in our area. And I thought these were cool. So I'm going to open one of them. And then the other one, I think I'm going to do a custom or a wheel swap or something. We'll see. This is the 911 Turbo 3.6 tuned. I mean, I don't pick these up, but I just thought it was funny looking. And it's a Porsche, so what the heck. Nice details on the back. 964 Turbo. Tail in the front. And there you go with that one. And the next one, first I wasn't going to pick it up because I feel that it's a little too big, but I did. And this is 1968 Dodge Dart GTS. This is a 68 Dodge GT plus 383 equals new Dart GTS. And I believe this is a new casting from M2. The first one that came out is actually in green, and the green it just didn't sit right with me. But I saw this one, and I like the hood, so I had to get it. Let's take it off the base. go. It's a nice yellow color. And then you got the nice stripe around the back there. It's very nice detail. I like how they did the detail on the back here. Chrome bumper. Front bumper is all chrome. And I don't believe the hood opens. It looks like it does, but I don't think it does. And this part is plastic, actually. And you get a plastic base. And I didn't realize that small wheels on the front, and you get big ones in the back. So, there you go with that piece. 
if it was there. And then the last piece I found, and I actually put it together because it was a Dodge truck in this M2 model kit. And I started doing the video putting it together, but it got too long and it was just not that great. So there's the booklet it comes with. And it comes with this lift. And it's a 1972 Dodge truck. And here it is put together. Nice orange and white. Which I think looks really cool. I like these rims. Came with two sets of rims, but I chose those. And there's the rear end. The tailgate. 1973 and the bucket. The only thing I don't like is this is the second model they had an issue with. The tail lights, as you can see, it sticks out. I'll try to see if I can fix that. And then you got this nice front grille. Inserted headlights. Chrome bumper. And then it has engine in there. A Helifont engine. Had two versions that you could use. This one or a stock engine. And I chose this one since it's a stock or a custom truck. And there you go, the 1972 Dodge pickup truck from M2. And that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. <coughs> Excuse me. And we will catch you at the next video. Bye.